Hi, this is Eric. Welcome to Smart Data Special. In this episode, I'll show you guys how to install a software without any errors. Um, the trick is you have to run as an administrator. So let's talk about users on your computer. So if you go to search and you type user and you go to add, edit, remove user, um, you will get this window here, which is user information. And I'll put this on my side here. So uh, if you click on your information, you're gonna see uh, the username, the user you have. I have one user so far, and uh, you can see their administrator. You can add another user who is the guest. And uh, let me see a baby shortcut user, change user. Yeah, so that's the um, really I wanted to show you. But um, here, meaning I am the administrator right now, I can run everything. But for those people who are not admin, and sometimes it may not work, Some, sometimes it may not work. So if you're the administrator on your own computer, um, you don't have to do really anything, it's the same thing. But if you're not, you may need to run your software as as uh, administrator. I mean, yeah, any software or any installation. So if you've already downloaded the file, maybe from the box, you put them in the setup. All you need to do is you right click, and uh, this doesn't give me that option. Maybe it's because it's. So let's go to use. If you guys remember this PC, C drive smart data and if you don't know how to get to this point or if you don't have these folders please watch uh, episode one or episode two of this video series so i'm gonna go to setup here right click and i should see that option as to run as administrator and most of the times try to do this habit try to do this habit whenever you install something it may help you and sometimes whenever you open these Microsoft products, um, you will be like running the database and all that you can um, uh, run as administrator. So I'll show you, for example, if this is Visual Studio. We may need Visual Studio down the road. I think I left it behind from the tools, but uh, no worries. Uh, you will see that down the road. Um, right now, if you go to, um, Let's say I need to do uh, Visual Studio here. All you need, you can open here or right click and run as administrator. Sometimes uh, you may try to create a folder or a file using Visual Studio. You may get an error stating that you don't have uh, uh, permission for some reason. So if you run this as administrator, you avoid all those kind of issues. So same to installation, once you, do, you download your files, to avoid errors or to make sure that your program installs everything, just right click and run as administrator. So this is not um, uh, the program, that's why you don't see that option and like the, um, the menu changes depending on what you are clicking on. So if you click on the side, you won't see that option you see that you won't see that option you have to be uh, really on the program and run as a administrator so that's how you install softwares without any errors thank you very much i will talk to you guys on my next episode peace